Yo, what's up ladies and gentlemen, this is Jesus from Everything Nerdy Assemble here on YouTube. And today, I want to show you the new releases of the week, but I'm going to do it a little bit different than my other previous videos. We're going to start it off with a more in-depth list at, at what's releasing for this week and on what console. Shout out to Game Informer for this list. First up we have Team Sonic Racing, releasing for the PlayStation 4, Xbox One, Switch, and PC, releasing May 21st. Next up, Assassin's Creed 3 Remastered, with Liberation Remastered. So it's two games for one for the Switch. Next up, Observation for the PlayStation 4 and PC, May 21st. Observation was one of the games that was shown by PlayStation in the first state of play. Next up, Resident Evil for the Switch, May 21st. Resident Evil 4 for the Switch, May 21st. Resident Evil 0 for the Switch May 21st. Everybody Skull VR for the PlayStation 4 May 21st. Total War Three Kingdoms for the PC May 23rd. Now on this next part of the video, I'm going to show you the games in my opinion that are the games that you need to keep your eyes on and that look like they're worth buying. First up we have American Fugitive for the PlayStation 4 Digital. Also releasing on Xbox One. I personally cannot wait for this game. This is my most anticipated game of this week. Now what is this game? A modern take on classic sandbox action. Framed for your father's murder, you'll need to do whatever it takes to unveil the real culprit. Tackle thrilling missions of the criminal underworld. Just don't let the cops track you down. Set in the deep south of the 80s, American Fugitive is a love letter to the classic movies and games of old. If you want to see more of this game, on this channel I uploaded two videos where you can get more information about the game and also a look at more gameplay. 
the next game of the week is Starless. Releasing for the PlayStation 4 digitally. And best of all, it's a free to play game. Let's take a look at this game. Take a look first at the announced trailer. Then we'll take a look at the gameplay. Let's take a look at gameplay of this game. Took me 20 years to find the men in black. Go get him, rookie. Say to follow you. Shout out to IGN for this gameplay video. Game looks pretty cool. I will definitely be checking it out and uploading a video with my impressions on the game. It reminds me graphics wise of Fortnite and the game reminds me of Monster Hunter, which is a pretty cool mix. The next game Everybody's Golf VR for the PlayStation VR, releasing digital and retail. Hold up. I forgot to describe the game. As a slayer, you are all that stands between your world and the Beckham. Beckham Boots. I can say that word. Behemoths that seek to devour it. Take on boss-sized monsters, forge powerful weapons, and craft armor from the very creatures you slay, all in a massive free-to-play online world. Everybody's Golf VR, PlayStation VR, digital and retail. Let's take a look at a little bit of gameplay of this game. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. If I had PlayStation VR, I'd definitely check that out. Step on the course like never before in the most immersive everybody's golf experience yet. Swing for the flag with your PlayStation Move motion controller or DualShock Four wireless controller. Play through three incredible courses. Practice your putting on the green or tee off at the driving range to perfect your swing. The next release of the week, Observation for the PlayStation 4 Digital. 
This is the game that, that was shown by Sony at the first state of play. Let's take a look at this game. That looks so fucking cool. That's the next game that I'm the most excited about for this week. The next game. Team Sonic. Observation is a sci-fi thriller uncovering what happened to Dr. Emma Fisher and the crew of her mission. Through the lens of the station's artificial intelligence, Sam, players assume the role of Sam by operating the station's control systems, cameras, and tools to assist Emma in discovering what is happening to the station, the vanished crew, and Sam himself. The next game, Team Sonic Racing, releasing for the PlayStation 4 Digital and Retail. Let's take a look at this game. That looks so fucking cool too. That is my third pick of the week that I'm the most excited about. And the last release of the week, Virtual Virtual Reality for the PlayStation VR Digital. Let's take a look at this game. realities of AI clients. Simply put on and remove different virtual labor access points to jump now into reality. Humans do it best. Patterns, desires, decisions chosen at whim. How about another headset? How about another headset? What is virtual virtual reality? Put on VR headsets and VR to dive into nested worlds and escape your AI manager Chaz. Activitude, the, virtu the virtual labor system, assures you that your 
artisanal human companionship is still highly valued by our AI clients. Even if the request seemed eclectic, feeling destructive, vacuum away realities with your activitude, brand poly cleanup tool. It seems like we have a pretty great week of new releases. In the comments below, tell me which of these games you're the most excited about. The next half of the video, I'm going to highlight other games that I feel are worth keeping your eyes on. The first one is Dollhouse for the PlayStation 4 Digital and Retail releasing May 24th. Let's take a look at a little bit of this game. That looks very intriguing. What is this game? This haunting horror game draws you into the mysterious atmosphere of film noir. Delve deep into the mind of Mary, a detective trying to unravel the secrets of her past. Memory by memory. Use the focus feature to see through the eyes of your pursuer as you try to survive a suspenseful game of cat and mouse. Sounds fucking interesting. Next game I want to highlight is Killing Floor Double Feature. The reason because you get the two games for the price of price of one plus. It now has PlayStation VR. The next game is Skelly Celeste for the PlayStation 4 Digital. This game seems to be inspired by. I forgot the name of the game, but it's oh yeah, the the binding of Isaac. Let's take a look at this game. very fucking cool too. I love the music. And that is it for this week's new releases. If you enjoyed the video, please hit that like. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Hit the notification bell if you're already subscribed for upcoming videos, which the next video would be will be a look at Rage 2. I downloaded it yesterday. I will be playing it and uploading the video with my impressions as I play a piece of it. Also, don't forget to share this video. I appreciate every single one of you. Thank you for watching.